All right, today is Sunday, April the 15th, so a little under a month after the last plants were set out. You can see that they're about halfway up. For the most part, they're standing on their own. They're not falling on the, the fence too much except when the wind blows. Uh, we do have quite a bit of fruit set going on, so if I can get it to show. Those are mostly just flowers there. There is some fruit back on the back side there. And there's some there as well. So those are sugar gems. And then as I come down here, we'll get into the sun golds right here. And you should start to see quite a bit more fruit set. Good stuff, lots of flowers. Uh, we haven't switched over to any type of real flowering a nutrient regimen yet. We're still anticipating another kind of two months of good weather so we'll give it another week or two before we start pushing them very hard to flower and set fruit. There's another truss there. These are also, these are a week behind sun golds. That week that they're behind is the week where things really start to go fast so quite a significant difference from the ones but there is still again here's some fruit set up under there quite a bit these are sugar gems now I believe yeah sugar gems so some fruit set there as well so looking pretty good uh, so far the trellising is is working okay we're not pruning anything we're just kind of hands off with the exception of the drip irrigation system and then here's the last group that's uh, another week behind. So we should have a nice good staggered harvest out of it. I'm going to come around to this side and give you kind of a view from in this direction. And then I'll go around the far side and let you compare to the, the oldest plants. So there you go, there's the comparison. Do got a little shade from this tree here in the morning, but they get good full sun from about 11 o'clock onward. Well, there it is, April 15th.